Right. A little bit of a gear change now. Next up tonight, there's a double act. One of them's talented and hilarious, and the other one's a cheeky little fella who gets on everybody's nerves. Sounds familiar. What? 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 <laughs> it's ventriloquist Jimmy Leahy. My name's Jamie, I'm 13, and I'm from St. Helens. I live with my mum, my dad, my brother, and my sister. And don't forget me! And Chuck. Little bit of sunshine. At our first audition, I was a bit nervous, but Chuck loved it. Where would you be without a laugh, eh, Chuck? Sat in David's seat. <laughs> you have an incredible talent to entertain people. I started ventriloquism in the first lockdown. Yeah, and he's still learning. What a horrible shirt. He said it, not me. Out. <sighs> Chuck's cheeky, he's a little bit naughty, and he sometimes gets me into trouble. Oi, stop copying me. We'll get expelled. We go everywhere together. Yeah, I can't go anywhere without you. I feel peckish. Oh, but you can't go in there. We've rehearsed a lot for the semi-final. We're not going to wing it. No, we want to win it. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Jamie, and this is my little friend Chuck. Oh, what are you doing? I'm just trying to get my hand comfortable. Any further, and you'll pull out an egg. <laughs> We're here, Britain's Got Talent live shows. You are live on ITV. Do not swear. <laughs> you don't have to tell me that. Can you believe they invited us back? They must have really liked us. Alicia really liked me. <laughs> I'm talented. Oi, this is a double act. Yeah, but what do you actually do? <laughs> do everything for you, Chuck. You'd be lost without me. Ignore them, Alicia. He never washes up. He never cleans up. He never brushes up. <laughs> he does nothing. Jamie does nothing. <laughs> Stop it. You're embarrassing me now. Yeah, like you need help with that. You're the one talking to a chicken. <laughs> Right, I'll give you one last chance. Take a good look around this audience and find yourself a beautiful lady. There aren't any. <laughs> Have another look. What are you doing now? I'm still looking. <laughs> See, Chuck, you're doing it again. I mean, how could one chicken make so many stupid mistakes in one day? I get up really early. <laughs> right, that's it, Chuck. I've had it. You've gone and ruined our big moment. Aww. And now I think it's time we go our separate ways. You mean you're getting rid of me? That's what it's come to, Chuck. He's getting rid of me. <laughs> Would you like to sign a chicken? <laughs> That's fine with me, Chuck. I could be funny without you. You're not funny with me. <laughs> Listen, I'm sorry. Can we still be friends? Oh, Chuck. We'll always be friends. What would I do without you, eh? When life is tough and times are cruel, pick up the phone. He'll be there for you. That's Chuck. Ah. Chuck's his name. Let's go! With a cheeky smile and a joke or two, he'll make Chuck's 
Alicia, let's start with you. Jamie, the light relief we all needed. <laughs> Thank you so much. I've missed you, Chuck. It's so nice to have you back. You're as cheeky and funny as always. Thank you. <laughs> no, you were fabulous, Jamie. Your voice is amazing as well, your singing voice. Well done. Another brilliant performance. Thank you. show where you can you can launch from screaming at touching a rat yeah. to singing along with a chicken <laughs> I'm still reeling from one thing and then you come on and you brightened up the whole show you are very talented young man Jamie <laughs> this is an extremely hard this is you know ventriloquism is a very difficult genre and I think you've you've done you've got a very slick act you're very professional I completely believe in both you and Chuck and honestly this is the kind of thing I would like to see on the Royal Variety Show more of this please well I mean I, I was thinking the same thing which is that I don't know who came up with the running order tonight where it's like you know one minute we've got rats and maggots and then you arrive with a chicken um, <laughs> However, the, the semi-finals, the finals, are about are you able to take a step up? And you were very kind of, you were good on your first audition. I think you were way better, honestly, tonight. I really do. Because I think there was something really, like you said, you're kind of cheeky and you're charming. And people like this kind of act. Yeah. And I think there's an awful lot of people. Um, where are you from again? Tell me. I'm from St. Helens. Are Woo! you? OK. <laughs> I have a feeling there are going to be a lot of people, however, say, how, what, how do they vote now? Point, whatever. QR code. <laughs> whatever. Look, we don't, we don't are going to, to be that. voting for you after this performance because they're going to want to see you do well because you're, you really, really did well. And no nerves. Really quick. You remind me of me at your age if I'd been funny. Um, <laughs> you're brilliantly talented. You're a born entertainer. I've no doubt you are going to have the most incredible career outliving all of us. Thank you, Thank you. If you think Jeremy deserves a place in the final, the details are on your screen. But don't forget, you can't vote until the last act has done their thing. Let's hear it for him one more time. Jeremy Lee. <laughs> Time for a break, but we'll be right back with the last two acts of the night, magician Junu and opera sensation Maxwell Thorpe. Plus, you can start voting for your favourites. See you for that in just a few minutes. Yeah. 